Hi, I'm Brenda Yoho and welcome to Solution Saturday. Well, I started out today with a very chilly uh, morning for um, soccer. It was my grandson's last day for soccer for the year. So it was exciting for all of the little ones. As they finished up their game, they had the opportunity to, to receive a little medal. And so he was really excited, even though I was freezing. Um, I don't think I'm ready for this colder weather. Um, fall is usually my favorite time of the year, but it seems like it switched pretty quick from being um, really warm to now really chilly, um, but I'll get used to it. So speaking about a little bit of change and things, uh, it's October, so things um, are getting ready to change for everyone as we'll soon be changing our clocks and we'll have a fall break for many of our schools. And this is the time when we need to really check in with kids. And October happens to be Bully Awareness and Prevention Month. So one of the things that I know I've talked about in the past is about that kids really want to feel good about being at school and they want to feel safe. And those are the two rules that I have and I've had those for many years. and. I really truly do believe those are the most important things we can do for our kids and for our staff, for our parents and for the community. Everybody wants to feel good. Everybody wants to feel safe, but our kids really, really need that from us. And one of the things that is going to happen this month is on October the 18th, I sent out a couple of blog posts about that. It's um, Unity Day. So I encourage everybody to wear orange and really step up your game and really fighting for everybody coming together for kindness and appreciation and for inclusion and really acceptance of everyone. Because today um, I was excited about having the opportunity to go watch my grandson play in his soccer games because he's so excited and so happy and the happiness that I saw in the field. I was saddened by the news this morning, um, listening to the things that are happening over in Israel. And there seems to be so much that's negative in our world. And I really, really, really would love for everybody to take just one day on October the 18th, wear orange, Get your kids, get your families, get your community, get your staff, everybody behind just taking the one day and celebrating each other and thinking about the things that you can do to really start focusing on the positives that you have going on within your schools, within your community, within your homes. There's a lot of positive things that we could talk about and celebrate and really make a focus. And I encourage you to do that. I'm not gonna take a lot of time today in taking up your time. And I just want you to know that I'm here. If you have questions, if you need some help, some ideas, please message me, uh, yohobren at gmail.com. Uh, my website is brendayoho.com. I'm always available to help in any way that I can. I really want to see everybody unite. I think it's so important that we do so. It's time for us to do so. We have so many people arguing and fighting and so much division, not just here in our country, but around the world. So it's time everybody to unite and let's start appreciating each other and knowing that we each are valued. You matter. Don't anybody ever tell you that you don't because you do. You're appreciated for everything that you do today, tomorrow, and the things you did yesterday. It's time to start spreading the kindness and acceptance and understanding that we're all different, but we all together can make so many things happen. And our kids need us more today than they ever have before. We need to teach them 
help them, guide them, support them, do everything that we can to make sure that they understand that they matter, they belong, they're appreciated, and it's okay to be different. The differences that we have make us unique, and that's okay because we can do so many things. So join me on October the 18th and wear orange and celebrate kindness, appreciation, equity, inclusion. I know people are saying they don't understand all these things, but it's just plain and simple. We just need to identify that we all have differences and that we all matter and that together we can be the solution. So practice my two rules and making sure that everybody feels good, everybody feels safe, and let's unify together on October the 18th and let's get this bullying stopped and let's start spreading some appreciation, some kindness, and some smiles. I'll see you next Saturday here on Solution Saturday. Thanks.